Hey everyone, I'm Joe, and for those of you who haven't followed me here on YouTube, I'm doing videos about luxury, specifically about designer bags, both brand new and vintage. So if you like this kind of videos, you can follow me here on YouTube as Joe Montano, and also on Instagram as Style by Joe. So for today, I would like to share this very special unboxing moment with you all, since this particular bag is like the epitome of me being a collector of designer bags for a long time and I just want to share this happy moment with you all. So I will share you a very quick story about how I acquired this special piece. This dream bag, as what other people are saying, the unicorn bag or the holy grail bag of them all. So uh, three, three to a month ago, yeah a month ago, definitely a month ago, I went into my local Hermes boutique store here in my city and um, I got this Hermes Bon Neo Clutch. I, as, as of some of you who have followed me here on YouTube for quite some time, I unboxed that uh, Hermes Neo Bon Clutch three weeks or a month ago. So I went to the store, I got that brand new from the Hermes store and I was able to uh, get acquainted and get to know this particular essay of mine who now became my friend. And so he introduced me about the clutches, about the new bun clutch because I'm looking for a clutch that I can be carefree about and I can use as, a, as my spring and summer bag. So I did purchase that bag. So after that, uh, we exchanged numbers. He gave me his uh, name card, his contact number, through the name card and we kind of like talking over uh, the iMessage. message and then after that one of those uh, moments that we were talking I was like jokingly telling him I jokingly told him that I would like to have a Birkin either a 35 size 35 or 40 in Togo or Clamont's leather in black either gold or silver hardware so I was kind of like telling him that I would like to have that bag and if you have that bag then it would be nice for you to consider me to have that bag. So after that, uh, after a few days, we talked again, said hi, hello, how are you doing? We, I established a relationship with him, a very friend, friend, friendly relationship with him since, it's, since he is very nice and I had a very great time with our mess three weeks ago when I got that bag, the Neobank Clutch. And then he just approached me and then he said that uh, question, do you really want that bag? And then with no doubt, I said, yes, yes, I would like to have that bag. And then after that, maybe after a few days, uh, he, he didn't respond or whatsoever. And then he just texted me one, one day and then he said that uh, I have a bag for you. So if you would like, then you can come to the store and see if it fits you well or if see how it, how, how it goes with you. I'm stuttering now, I'm sorry, because I'm really excited to, to open this bag. So yes, I, I got my Birkin bag and I will be revealing this bag to you all right now. All right, so it comes in a very large, iconic bag, orange bag that we know of. And of course the receipt there, there, and now the moment of truth. <laughs> so it comes in a very huge box. Here, a very huge box. And this is really a true unboxing since I haven't opened this bag the moment I got this from the store literally yesterday, April of 2021. So I'll unbox the box for you all. This really very civilized. Go. And then. And. Oh. Oh my god. There we go. Ah. Go. Go. Here it is. So basically it comes in a 
dust bag. And then comes with a care card. This is the care card. And basically it just tells you about the leather care and everything in different languages. Then the raincoat for rain protection. So now here's the bag. This is it. My first ever Hermes Birkin 40 in Noir Togo leather and Palladium hardware. So here it is. The bag, the Holy Grail, the unicorn bag, the epitome of them all. Do I have a purchase history with Hermes prior to being offered Ole the Birkin? The answer is yes, but only one. So three weeks ago, that's the first ever uh, product that I got from Hermes directly from the store. However, back in Asia, I acquired several Hermes pieces in the secondary market. So I have my Hermes bag, I have my my tote, my, my canvas totes, the photo and the other totes. Correct me if I'm wrong, you can write it down below. I will show it, I will show you the picture of those bags uh, somewhere here. And so yes, yeah, so I had a, a bullied uh, toiletry pouch in canvas. I had like two con canvas bags from Hermes and I have a an herb bag uh, that I got from the pre-owned market. And then here in my local city, three weeks ago, that's the first ever purchase that I got from Hermes store straight up. And after a couple of weeks since that purchase, since the Neobon clutch, I got offered with this bag. So based on my own experience, because prior to acquiring this bag, I've been researching a lot about Hermes about the Birkin bags, the Kelly bags. I've seen a lot of countless videos here on YouTube with the different bloggers and influencers stating about their first-hand experience in purchasing the bag directly from the store without any purchase history, such as Alyssa Lenore, hi to you, I love, I love, your, I love your videos, and others from the UK, and so on and so forth. And so after watching those videos, I was encouraged to uh, try it myself and see if it brings me positive, you know, uh, luck. Not real, it could be pure luck, it could be a coincidence, but as far as my own experience is concerned, I must say that in order for you to be offered this bag in my own experience, I'm saying it in my own experience, that you need to establish a good relationship with your essay. And not just a relationship because you're looking or you're aiming for the bag, but I don't know, you just have to have a genuine relationship with, with your essay. And that's what I did. So I became friends with him. I was not expecting him to offer the bag that fast, but yeah, I, I, I got offered and I took it. I grabbed the opportunity and here it is, here's the bag. So that's my story. If you like this type of videos, you can follow me on Instagram as Style by Joe because I post there way, uh, you know, firsthand compared here. And at the same time, you can follow me here on YouTube by subscribing on my channel and hitting the notification bell down below. Yeah, so that's it. So I'm very happy to share with this with uh, with, with with this to you all. And I must say that in conclusion dreams do come true and I never imagined that I would have that I would be having this bag that I would acquire this bag for for it was a dream I, I, I am lost for words right now and I'm very emotional and at the same time I'm very happy because yeah dreams do come true and if it happens to me as a normal Joe as an average Joe it will also happen to you so